Okay, so there's the park office, and on the road in, you might come past that. Yeah, you can't see. I can't and you see. come past those buildings back there. <laughs> and way back there is the visitor center. That's the first thing you'll come upon. I don't know what you're looking at. That, I see a lot of buildings. That silver roof way in the back. And then I'm going to try and zoom in. Yeah, and then if you keep coming up the road, then you end up back at the geological service um, visitor center out at this point. You come back. You get to that gift shop building, you get to the restaurant <laughs> Altavar building, you get to the, what's that hotel called? <laughs> and then you, you really should do this, because I okay. can't see what you're looking at. <laughs> okay. So when you come in on the road, way back here, you can see the building, like the park um, ranger building station, and then you come over, and over on this side is the visitor center and just a lot of parking lots and bus spots and then you come down over to here and that's where you've got the geologic museum building with incredible views indoor if it's raining then you come up here and you get to that um, El Tavar expensive hotel and fancy restaurant then you get into the other couple of hotels there I forget what they're called um, like the yeah Thunderbird and then you come down and you get into the main village and in the main village the first thing coming this way is going to be the main lodge building and then you see all those smaller little cabins that you can stay in and down in the front there's that really cool museum um, and then in the back you've got the place that has the cafeteria and the pizza place so just everything you kind of need is all right here back here is where a bunch of the rangers and staff people must live they say there's 2500 people that live in the park year round and again, from the top, flat. It's a plateau across the top. And there's haze from the 